Hello everyone, and welcome to Figure Review. I am of course your host, PWS Phil, and on this episode, we're taking a look at The Undertaker and Jack Swagger from WrestleMania Heritage. Now, I'm doing a double on this one because these are the only two figures I picked out from this series. And uh, right now, it seems you can find them mostly at Kohl's and uh, Walmart. And they retail anywhere from about 10 bucks to 12 bucks, depending on where you live in the country. Uh, the other figures in this set are Eddie Guerrero, John Cena, The Ultimate Warrior, and the game Triple H. Uh, I'll have something special about Eddie Guerrero at the end of the episode. So, as you can see here... We have The Undertaker from WrestleMania 21, when he faced Randy Orton. Very cool, very cool. Uh, when he came back as the dead man in 2004, he still kind of dressed like the American Badass, but his hair was a bit longer, shoulder length, as you can see here. And uh, instead of the skulls and whatnot, he went back to The Undertaker cross on the leather pants. Uh, this figure's pretty good. All the tattoos are there. I really love the new scan for Undertaker, and I hope uh, I hope they modify this scan for a possible WrestleMania 28 Undertaker, because I think it would look badass with the mohawk and everything. Very cool, very cool. Got his elbow pad and the MMA gloves and all that good stuff. Definitely a cool piece. And probably means we will see a basic uh, American Badass Undertaker somewhere down the line. Uh, for those of that kept up with Comic-Con, uh, they did announce and have the proto for an elite American Badass Undertaker in the very near future. So that is awesome news. Uh, also today, of course, we have Jack Swagger representing his WrestleMania 27 attire when he accompanied Michael Cole to the ring for his match against Jerry Lawler. And this is a good one. Uh, an ongoing thing uh, with Mattel is a lot of people were not happy with the Jack Swagger face scans. And I think this one is one of the best. Uh, I believe Jack Swagger's scans overall have been accurate. But uh, Jack Swagger has a very unique face. He can be an ugly motherfucker one second, and he can look like a GQ guy the next. So, depending on the face he makes and stuff, he could look like a goon or a fucking model. So, he's one of those weird-looking guys. It's really hard to capture an accurate scan of his face. Um, I believe his first one was perhaps too pretty, but I do believe his elite scan is very accurate to the face he makes. But uh, this is a newer one, a more... Uh, a kind of a blank emotion uh, face scan, and uh, I think it's pretty good, and the hair is accurate to the time. Of course, now he's got the fancy comb over and whatnot, but I think this is still a pretty solid figure. As you can see here, the uh, nice gold and purple trim on the attire. Well, mostly gold and black, and there is, uh, on the All-American Star, there is a uh, outline of purple, so pretty regal, pretty prestigious, the gold and purple designs. Of course, he's got the Batista boots uh, with gold detailing. Uh, the black wrist tape. You know, super accurate to the event. So very cool that they do these heritage figures. And I'm kind of glad they all are a part of the basic line now. So there's not like... got a, You don't have to wait on a basic series and the heritage. They'll all just come in the basic series. So very cool. I, I would love to see an elite version of this attire because, of course, those of you that know me know I'm an elite guy. I like the elite figures, but there are basic figures that I do enjoy, just like these two right here. Now, a little earlier I mentioned something special for you guys about Eddie Guerrero. And that is that I have a Heritage Eddie Guerrero for sale now on eBay. There he is, still in the case. As you can see, or in the box, I should say. And, uh, he is up for auction now on eBay, starting right at 10 bucks. Starting him cheap, and, uh, anybody who needs one, this is a good chance to grab one. Free shipping here in the States, and free tracking as well. So there you have it, Undertaker and Jack Swagger from WrestleMania Heritage. And please stick around to see what else I have for sale on eBay this week. Thanks for watching, guys. Now available on eBay.
Click the link in the description. Well, he's lost for